very first coffee brewing up at the Hogs Hangar. Yesterday, Heather kicked butt, or we did the last couple days, and I'm excited for my first coffee, Kenny, with my first actual coffee that I made here, and it's ready to go. Another thing I want to show you here, today I will do what others won't, so tomorrow I can do what others can't. And I want you to think about that for just a minute. You can take that saying and apply that to many, many areas of your life. And particularly in helicopter training or in your helicopter career, in your helicopter job. I'm Kenny Keller, creator of Helicopter Online Ground School and author of the Amazon number one bestseller, Helicopter Check Ride and Top 10 Check Ride Tips. Top 10 Check Ride Tips I did co-authored with Taz Chrisman, 2018 Flight Instructor of the Year. You can go down below to get a free paperback copy of any, either one of those books. We ship them to you for just shipping and handling. So go down below the link below to check that out. So welcome to day 118, Coffee with Kenny. Today I want to talk about inner pressures, the pressures that we put on ourselves. And I was thinking about this last night. Holly was in our video yesterday. She's still here, weather's still bad. And when we were talking yesterday, she said something really neat that her company said to her as she's doing this cross-country flight and dealing with all these weather issues, she said that her company is awesome and that they don't push her to fly. And that is awesome when you get a company that does that. And yesterday, and I wish I could remember the exact words, but one of her uh, managers said to her on the phone, he brought up the inner pressures. And he said, well, are you pushing yourself? And she said, no, absolutely not. And he said, okay, well, I just want to make sure that, you know, even though we're not pushing you and we want you to be safe, don't forget about the inner pressures because we put inner pressures on ourselves. You know, here's an aircraft that needs to get moved. You know, time is money. They're paying her wages. They're paying for hotels. Aircraft probably needs to get into service. And I thought it was really neat that he brought that up to her over the phone. And then she brought that up to me that he made that comment. And I said, you know, I think that's worthy of another video because I am guilty of always blaming this operator, that operator. You know, I had a lot of people that pushed me in my career and companies that pushed me in. And I didn't like it, right? I had one guy said, man, you really don't like being pushed to you. And I said, no, I don't like it one bit. I don't like it at all. And so on the flip side of that, since I'm always ready to blame everybody else, you know, there are inner pressures too. And we do put inner pressures on ourselves. And it can be just in the exact situation where the Holly talked about yesterday, where she's working for a company, she's out trying to move an aircraft safely, a two and a half day trip has turned into six or seven now. That's how it goes. So a person, any pilot could start pressuring themselves, even though the company's being cool and maybe a customer's being cool, maybe the only person really putting pressure on you is you. So I thought, you know what? That deserves a copy with Kenny. This has been a crazy week with moving and everything going on and Holly coming into town. I just thought I'm gonna just get right to the airport and shoot this one this morning and talk about it because it is one that I, 10 years of making video, uh, videos, I'm always blaming everybody else. But as pilots, we do this. So not only do you have external pressures, there are also always those internal pressures. So something to think about. And you know, we talk all the time about how we learn through repetition, right? Hey, there kicks on the heater. Well, we'll see how much that affects me, uh, affects my audio. Hopefully it won't be too bad using the handheld mic. Anyway, inner, inner, inner pressures, it's something that you have to think about it. And you have to put this in your daily routine, your daily life. You know, in training, it seems like people think you only need to hear something once. But you know what? That's not true. In training, we need to train and retrain and retrain. And we need to think about these things on a daily basis. We don't just learn it one time and then let it go out the window. We have to continually, over and over, work on these different things when, when it comes to you know, being safe in the aircraft, being safe with your own uh, personal well-being, all these things we have to take into consideration, we gotta think about them all the time. And that's one cool thing about hanging out with other pilots and coming to videos like this and people getting into discussions below because that's how we, you know, we keep these things fresh in our mind and that's how we, we stay safe. Stay, can't talk again. Oh well, um, that thing's even getting noisier. So I'm gonna wrap this up. I am Kenny Keller, creator of Helicopter Land Ground School. You can take our Helicopter Land Ground School for a 24-hour test flight down below. Our private commercial instrument or CFI monthly courses 
you can take it for a 24-hour free test flight. See the entire course for 24 hours. If, it, if it's something you're looking for, great. Just continue on with the training month to month, cancel any time. Or during that test flight, if you just think it's not for you, you just simply remove your credit card from within the site, or if you sign up with PayPal, end your subscription in PayPal, and you'll be billed nothing. We, we part as friends, you're welcome back anytime. So, all right, gonna get moving on my day. Remember the internal pressures along with external pressures when making your go, no go decisions. I've talked about Holly in the past several years since she trained with me. Holly is an example of how somebody does things right and takes the time and, and knows so much about maintenance and she knows the regs and she knows what's the right and she knows what's the right thing to do. And uh, she is an inspiration for all of us to someone who you know keeps their integrity and you know she's got some of her own stories that she's told me in the past like we all do right and it, it boils down to always doing the right thing having the guts to stand up for yourself and doing what's right and knowing what's right in your gut that's that's pretty much key so like and uh the video for me if you would give me a comment down below about weather decision making go no go inner pressures outer pressures Subscribe to the channel when you do click that uh, little bell that will pop up so you'll be notified of our daily video. And we will see you in day 119. Can't thank you all enough. And yes, I just wanted to see how long it would take for somebody to make a comment about my tag on the cup. All right, see you in day 119.